Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play The Feeble Files. We're currently in the uh, interrogation room slash torture chamber, um, which is not a very hospitable place as you can see. Um, we do need to find some water for, for Mandarin, the uh, um, you're not very well uh, rebel leader. Uh, let's see what we can do in the lift. So, I think we've got everything we can from the maintenance area. Um, let's try... I mean, the brain room sounds really important, doesn't it? Should we try research and testing first? Okay, there's a firing range. It must be used to test the stuff they make here. Okay, this fire extinguisher looks... Uh, like we can pick it up. A dry ice fire extinguisher. Dry ice, okay. Um, hang on, that's not pick up, is it? That's pick up. I'm sure that'll be of use. Anything else around here? No? Can we... Is there more to this screen? Can we walk off this way? There sure is. There's a button. I think it controls the vent. Ooh, why would I want to control the vent? I wonder. I might have to get back in the vents, might I? Antimatter weight. There's a lot of detail in this background here. Um, I do, I do admire some of the. Oh, there's nothing there. It's open at the moment. Interesting. I do admire the detail they put into some of this. Um, a lot of it is unnecessary and confusing, but um, I can appreciate the quantity of work. For sure. Oh, I can't! It's too heavy! Can you not zap it into, um... Oh, I can't! Oh, it's too heavy! But you don't have to physically pick up... It's got things. an on-off switch on the side. Oh, okay. Let's turn it off, then. Puzzle solved. Alright, so we've got like, the world's heaviest paperweight. It's got an on-off switch on the side. Um, and a, a dry, dry ice fire extinguisher. fire extinguisher. We've got something we can do with two vents. We look at the vent in the background. That could just be decoration, couldn't it? Rather than... It must be used to test the stuff they make here. Interesting that... I mean, they're... Are those firearms lying around? It looks like they probably are. So we're not we're not picking any of those up. Um, we can't use the terminals. Interesting. Well, let's press the button. I mean, it's there, isn't it? It's there to be pressed. I'm getting I'm getting lost vibes all of a sudden. It's closed at the moment. Okay. So uh, that's different to the state it was before, so I'm assuming that's good. Purely by the fact that I've done something. Alright, well that was that room. Let's go to the brain room. We're whizzing, whizzing through this game at the moment. We'll be done before tea time. Those gauges look like they're part of our, um, our user interface. Can't quite read what that sign says. So, no. Um, that's okay. <laughs> I think it's probably not important. I can't look at this giant van. Let's try and go left first. It looks like you. Oh, okay. You reckon the lift if you go left. Let's not do that. So I'm guessing at some point we're going to have to get a, uh, a higher security card, high clearance security card to get to the uh, the temple of the Omnibrain. Oh, okay. There's people there. Uh, brain slime. Okay. Oh, we 
have to walk over there. Oh, we have to go up. Oh, I didn't know you could get up there. Oh, why did you press your watch? Are we getting some brain slime? So this is it. This really is what the Omni Brain looks like. What? That's for my grandfather. I hope it gives you a real headache. The Omni Brain is a is a vat of liquid. Well, that's confusing. Uh, uh, we can interact with these company operatives, um, but I think I'm going to save it again first because I'm feeling things could go wrong quite quickly, so I'll be back with you in a moment. Hello, I've just saved and I've noticed that we don't have a new item, so I think there must have been a chain across the entrance to the the steps that took the us to the van. So that's what we picked up before we had the cutscene of spitting in the Omni Brain. Um, kind of a notion that we ought to be wearing the engineer's jacket. Let's see. I can't do anything with it. No. Okay. Uh, well, let's have a look, look at these guys then. All these citizens seem to look the same. Oh, that's interesting. Can we? They look rather Excuse small me. than you feel. How may I be of service to your citizen? Um, how come all of you look the same? Who all? Uh, you all. There's only one of me, citizen. Oh, yeah? Then who's that? Me. And what about that? Me again. Um... I am one person existing in different points in space. But in the same point in time. Uh, that really doesn't help, I'm afraid. I am the result of a time displacement experiment in the research labs. They were trying to discover a way to control time. And this is what happened. Temporarily focused people can find this confusing. But it's really quite simple. I see. Um... Just try and think of us as one person with three bodies. Right, uh, so five bodies. I think I can manage that. Um... My name's Clem, by the way. And what are their names? Clem! Oh, yeah, I thought that might be the case. Uh, <laughs> I think I've uh, just got something else to do right now. A good cycle, uh, Clem, Clems, whatever. Okay, well, if this is the Omni Brain, then can we not just throw a grenade in there or something? I feel like this this is just empty space. We can't go into the distance, I don't know if that helps. Oh, okay, it does. Okay, well, that wasn't obvious, was it? It's only because I've been playing this. Uh, this game for so long. What? How is that not a thing? How are these not things? Danger do not pull. Uh, I'm confused that we can't interact with anything here. This all looks like it's uh, pretty interactable. Interesting. Hmm. What's leaking from that tap? Interesting. Well, I haven't really found anywhere to get some water, have I? Um, can I talk to Clem a bit more? Um, and get any help or anything? So, um, Clem, what are you doing here? I maintain the Omnibrain's cerebral cortex. The vat of goo? Correct, citizen. Although goo is hardly an appropriate term, it's an extremely complicated mass of neural tissue, which requires very careful monitoring. What's the uh, neural tissue for? What's the uh, neural tissue for? It serves as a knowledge base for the Omnibrain. Certain citizens' brain tissue is deemed worthy to be added to it and become part of the glorious creature. 
Are you saying that if you get someone who seems suitable... Rigorous tests are run on their brain tissue to determine suitability. We remove undesirable characteristics. And then you dump their brains in there? You are correct. In essence, although there's a lot more to it than that, special chemicals are also added, developed by myself, which enable the new matter to link up with the old. Okay. Uh, don't you find this uh, situation kind of don't strange? Don't you find this uh, situation kind of strange? Which situation? It's really quite simple. When you get the hang of it, there can be drawbacks, however. I get the same pay for doing three times the work. You should complain. Form a union or something. <laughs> really, citizen? You're not the first person to make that comment. Or the one about pulling yourself together. All right, all right. It's just a joke. I think it would help if only one of you spoke at once. Ruse, um, I really think I ought to be leaving now. Goodbye. Did you say you developed the chemicals that enable the Omnibrain to Did work? Did you say you developed the chemicals that enable the Omnibrain to work? That is correct, citizen. So you made the Omnibrain? Incorrect, citizen. The Omnibrain has always been here. But, um, he just said that... I said no such thing, citizen. What you see before you is merely the cerebral cortex of the Omnibrain. The memory, if you will. The Omnibrain itself is housed in an entirely different area. So, uh, that's not it then? Correct, citizen. That is not it. You must have been around a while to know all this. I was here in the first period, citizen. The first period? But that's... 8,732 period, citizen. Longevity is a side effect of the temporal distortion. I have not aged since that day. Wow. You must get very bored all by uh, yourself all the time. Monitoring the Omnibrain is a full-time job, citizen. Wow. I mean, like 8,000 years. Um, let's be rude. I think it would help if only one of you spoke at once. I am. See? I can speak in series with myself. But it is not easy to keep track of where I am. Sometimes it gets very confusing. I can imagine. Okay. I really think I ought to be leaving now. Uh, goodbye. Good cycle, citizen. Okay. Uh... I wonder if we can now interact with anything at the back of the vat. Uh, now we have some more information about what's going on. That would be helpful. No, just this way, Phoebe, please. Okay, what's this thing? Can I interact with it? No. What's up here? Tap. Right, this area is very weird. I guess whatever we're supposed to do hasn't happened yet. Alright, so we've got brain slime, right? What if we freeze the slime? Even using my new rebel training, I fail to see how that's possible. Wow, it's well worth walking all the way over there just to get that result, isn't it? Okay, let's just go far enough to get the brain slime hotspot to turn up. What if we uh, bomb it? It's not a bad idea, is it? Surely. No way of getting any sort of result out of that. Okay. Um. Can we? 
do anything with Clown? I'm fighting for the rebellion, not running a charity. Okay, I was thinking of a more uh, aggressive use for that, but that's that's fine. Um, I'm fighting for the rebellion, not running a charity. Okay. Uh, hmm. So, as far as I can tell, anyway. Uh, Nothing's really adding up. I guess we can try and see what happens if we go to the temple. I suspect it's going to say we haven't got the clearance for it. I haven't got clearance to go there. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, research and testing. What if we... Um, it would seem appropriate to use a grenade on the, uh, the firing range, wouldn't it? Well, not appropriate, but... Uh, okay, somewhat intuitive. Wow. Okay, it still looks the same. I wonder what that was supposed to achieve. Will anything be different anywhere else? That's below the brain room, isn't it? So, I wonder if that means something's different here? Claim is still here. Machinery is still working. Anything around the back? Everything's still as it was. What if we need to go back to the vents to um, to do anything? Maybe we can get to the Omnibrain through the vents. I might need to make a a little map uh, for myself as I go along. So we need to go. I guess we could maybe get back to it through... I don't know if they would have rendered it both ways. I'll try maintenance, as that's closer to get to that the surface at this point. See if we can get back in the hole through there. Um, the vent was on the other side of the bridge, I think. There. No, can't get there. Or can I? Yeah, it looks like it, yeah, okay. I was anticipating they might have animated all that just to say, well, I can't do that. Alright, so from maintenance forward. Okay, there's go. Oh, just go back. Well, that doesn't make a lot of sense, does it? We might do if I change something in the ventilation ventilation system. Um, we'll look up. Okay. Okay. Um, for, how am I going to map this forward dead end? So I have to be looking up and down, don't I? So face face forward. Oh, this is so confusing. <laughs> These discreetly rendered three D bits. I mean, if it if it was just like a two D maze, that would be fine. Be absolutely fine. So I can't. Yeah. So you can't. That is just a dead end. That's fine. So if you go back to. The start. Okay, so look up, and then move up, up there's left, forward, 
Oh, so this might be the one I was taking before, maybe. Um, looks similar anyway. So you can go left or forward. So I think we came from there, so let's go forward. Oh, okay. What's this? A fan. Can I... I can't tell which one does what. Oh, excuse me. Can I... On the fan? No. I'm not going near that thing. I'll be minced. Okay. Um... Can I... Can't turn that on. I don't think. Okay. Anything else you can do with a fan? Uh, use the chain in it? No? I feel like that's something we probably need to interact with. Um, anything else that would be good for... I mean, any of these, any of these solid objects would help to destroy the fan, wouldn't they, really? How about the um, metal bar? Seems like this, we've already used it for something else. Hmm. Okay, let's go back to the um, maintenance room for now. We can remember the way. So this, yeah, should be a turn right. I don't know if it's supposed to be. Oh, can I go forward this way? I can. Yeah, okay. Um, I don't know if we're supposed to be remembering this internal geography. Um, it's certainly not clear to me, but this should be the maintenance room, right? Okay. Let's. I can't tell which one does what. I wonder if that's a um, a hint. I wonder if we need to keep testing the grenades at the firing range until we work out something um, about them. This one. Hopefully, this is going to be fruitful. Okay, that seemed like the same effect as before. Maybe we need to be in the room and do it more than once. Okay, yeah, that's different. Oh, okay, now there's gas in there. Interesting. Alrighty, um, I think we're going to leave it there for this episode. And I'll have a think about how any of these things might combine together uh, next time uh, thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed the episode and um, i'll see you again next time till then take care bye bye <laughs>